Even a month later, with a look at this neighborhood, it's easy to tell that something devastating happened here. The plane parts are gone. Most of the debris from shattered homes has been removed. The police and firemen and their vehicles have left. But the sensation of tragedy lingers. The curious, the sightseers, drive through in cars or stroll the sidewalks at the site of the nation's worst air disaster, a disaster which, in a matter of seconds, meant death for 144 people. It's been a grisly and very difficult job, but in the time since the crash, the coroner's office has been able to identify nearly every person aboard Flight 182 and those killed on the ground. Our work has proceeded very, very well, uh, better than our best expectations. We expected to reach the 90 percentile of identification. As of today, there are four people remaining to be identified, and we're still continuing with that activity. The four victims yet unidentified, Stark says, probably will not ever be identified. But they were aboard Flight 182 and died in this neighborhood. For the living, death is the greatest mystery, and that mystery clings to this section of San Diego. Doug McAllister, News 8, North Park.